Hey, welcome back to another episode of Battletech. In the previous episode, we worked on a campaign mission and we got through it. You know, it was a little difficult, but uh, I think we did pretty good considering. None of our mechs were permanently injured, so that was kind of nice. And we're now at a point where we still need to rescue Madeira, but I think we are going to have to take some missions first um, before that campaign mission is available. So we'll be looking for contracts in this episode. Okay, there's nothing here, so I guess we need to go ahead and just start navigating. I want to say I started doing that last time, but I don't remember. Let's see, where are we going to go? Oop, that one's a little difficult. Everything that we've got is pretty much going to be difficult from now on. Uh, because the game is, you know, we're progressing through the game. Let's see, is there any places? There's a three and a four. Three and a half. We can handle a three and a half if we're careful. That's a three and a half as well. It's uninhabited. I don't want to go there or there. We want to find a good place. It's going to take forever no matter where we go. There's a black market. Can't use those still. Now, along the borderline, I bet we can't travel there, can we? Yeah, travel restricted. I'm guessing uh, because we haven't completed the campaign, we can't go there yet. What about this direction? Four. Yeah, I mean, just not... Well, that would be... Inner sphere, moderate population. I mean, that's not too bad. Uh, but that one? Uh, I don't want to go too far. I have a feeling we're going to have to come back pretty quick here. Uh, that one's not great either. I don't know. Maybe we should just pick one and go. This one looks okay. Except for, did it just say travel not po We can't travel there. Okay. We can't travel to any of these. So we have to come back. Well, that stinks. I guess we'll go to Itram and see what they've got. It's three and a half. Uh, we've been there before. Roger that, Commander. Course plotted. Okay, we have arrived. Let's see what the store's got. Waypoint reached, Commander. Okay, what do we got? We got an awesome, which we already have one of. Quick draw, locust, spider, stalker 3F. Uh, what's this one? This is the one, okay, this is the one that's got four missiles, but six laser points. Eh. Thunderbolt, nothing really good. Some arm mods that aren't bad, but we don't really need those. And then a leg mod. Yeah, I mean, we're not... We're at a point now where I think most of the mechs are too strong for us to melee as a primary weapon. I think that, you know, if we're close and we can punch, great. But I don't think... Uh, I don't think it's something we need to be using right now. Okay, well, let's look at the contracts. Let's just see what they've got. I really don't want to jump again if I don't have to. Alright, well, there's a three. Defend base. Uh, three and a half ambush convoy. There's a four battle. I don't know. I don't know if we're ready for that one. There's a battle. It's three and a half. It's definitely going to be rough, but let's try that one. And I don't know. We're getting some good mechs, possibly, um, since we're actually getting up in difficulty. So maybe we, I don't know, maybe we go ahead and go for a few salvage points in this one. Okay. First thing I need to do is take Storm out. Storm, you did great, but uh, we want my guy back in. There we go. And, oh, that's right. They took out one of our mechs, so we're going to put the awesome back in. And where's Behemoth? There we go. Okay, so our goal here is to try to level up everybody real quick, and then uh, hopefully not die in this mission. All right, with a battle, we can handle a battle, typically. Oh, the weather is uh, wonderful. We've got uh, solid intel that the enemy lance is in the region. Sweep the area, find them, and clear them out. Okay, well, we know this is going to be more difficult, so we are going to be very careful. Acknowledged. 
Now, I don't know if the missions in this game are similar to MechWarrior 5, where the campaigns are actually slightly more difficult than the regular missions. So, you know, this is a three skull, but we don't know for sure if, you know, can we handle a three skull okay? Or actually, this is a three and a half, my, my mistake. Uh, let's see, let's go ahead and run there. On my way. On my way. The weather is just Happy awful. I'd hate to do missions in like pouring rain. That would make I think everything difficult. I wonder, you know how weather affects your heat in some levels. I wonder, does the rain do anything for you? You know, if you're too warm, can you uh, do you cool down naturally in the rain? Position confirmed. You betcha. Okay, so what do we got? Oh, did that say 85? That did. Okay. Uh, Behemoth, you can't go very fast, so we're going to put you right here. Now, once again, we have to keep the Marauder at a safe distance. So we will let them come to us if possible. I'm guessing we've got, as I say, we've got some smaller mechs in addition to the big boy. Let's do, you know, Decker, we're not... Well, here, let's do a move. Let's get you up here. And I want to be able to shoot with glitch, so ah, oh, that's gonna be just just outside of our range. Okay, so we'll just wait. Okay, glitch. Yeah, we're we're just gonna wait. Let's just reserve. Let's see what the enemy does. I, and I don't know, do we have... Okay, I say there's more than one. What was that, a 60? Alright, Behemoth. For orders. Can Behemoth see anything? No. In fact, I think I'm going to bring Behemoth to this side. That way we can kind of cover our right flank just in case that one tries to come around. It's kind of off to the right there. Okay, here comes the 85 tonner. And glitch. Let's identify him. Can we sensor lock from here? Got a lock. Okay, so it's a battle master. You know, we haven't seen a lot of those. Uh, my character can actually see them. And I want to make sure we are in full bulwark here. So we're going to move in. And I'm going to go ahead and take some shots. We'll get to shoot before his turn anyway, so yeah, let's just do it. Alright, some solid hits. We just uh, melted some armor. Okay, there's a fourth mech now, but it's a low tonnage one. It's a 30. I'm trying to think of what a 30 is. It's like a fire starter or something like that. I am horrible with my tonnages. Okay, here comes the little one. That's a cicada. Now that's like a 40 ton, right? Okay, he missed. We are going to split our forces slightly. I hear ya. Glitch, I actually... I really don't want to go after you. Decker. That, we can't... Okay, hold on here. Let's see. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Let's identify some mechs. Because if we can see him, we can launch at him. See, that is the Battle Master. Yeah, we're going to do Precision Strike on the Battle Master. Let's go for the head. Got it. All right, missed, but that side is shredded. Nice. Okay. Now we gets to move, what, the 60 ton? No? Okay, glitch. What can I do for you? I think glitch, we're just going to move you over here. We're all kind of hunkered down on this little ledge, and I don't want to really move from it. Uh, can we split? I think we want to split. We're going to give the missiles to him and the lasers to you. Which is not a great shot, but, I mean, that's going to lower some of your uh, your dodge, so... Your evasion. Take the arm, take the arm. Yes! Nice. And we, ooh, we did some good damage on that one too. Okay. So who's moving now? Uh-oh. 
We have picking up a new sensor trace. Yes. Looks like enemy reinforcements. Great. That's not cool at all. Okay, so based on where you are, can you just fire on him again? Yeah, let's just keep working this dude. He's an 85. Okay, so it's almost done. Enemy mech. Critical damage. Now who gets to move? Is that 60 tons? Is that a dragon? Nope. It is a quick draw. Okay. Little damage, but that's not a big deal. The cicada is really not too big of a deal. Um, and we can see both. Do we want to go ahead and keep working? I think... This is dangerous, but I think I want to go ahead and go after the Battlemaster some more. The, uh... The Cicada... What, what's the Cicada guy? It's got a PPC. But... I don't know. I feel like we could just finish this guy off. Or not. Oh, so close. Okay, well next turn it's dead. That's kind of why I was worried. I mean, it didn't do that much to us. It kind of spread it around with those lasers. Damage minimal. Honestly, the quick draw is probably a bigger threat than he is now. Although he's moving in closer, so we definitely want to take care of him. Okay, and a javelin. What, a missile or laser? Okay, laser javelin. Now that hurt a little bit. All right, do we get a turn now? Cicada moving? No, another missile mech. Well, they're shooting at us, but they're far away. We're going to probably move the Marauder though. Okay, at least he missed. Machine gun fire is not a problem. Minimal damage on that hit. Okay, so what do we want to do first? We want to kill a mech. So I'm gonna stand right here. Aye, aye. Back up just slightly. And we got precision strike, so we're gonna try to kill the javelin. Let's just see if we can headshot the thing. All weapons are go. No, but we did get a solid hit on it. He's definitely hurt. Okay, glitch. Waiting for orders. Glitch can shoot on everybody, so let's Let's just do two, maybe? I read you, Commander. Moving Actually, you know what? We may do another turn when we fire the lasers. They're not really great, but... Uh, okay, so lasers. Yeah, and yeah. Okay. Now, I don't know if this will kill anyone. All right, all on A. Let's give this to C. And maybe... B. And make this one B, and that one C. Okay, let's see if that works. I, I don't think we're gonna kill. We might kill the Battlemaster. I mean, it's pretty hurt. The Centurion or the Centurion, the Javelin's gonna take a lot of damage, and then we'll see what the Cicada does. Then, then we have to cool down for a turn. Uh huh. All right, we hit with three on him, so that's definitely yeah, that did something. Now let's see the missiles. Trying to optimize here. Got him. All right, well that was one down. And we got a leg on that one, which is perfect. There's That's exactly what we needed. Wrong. We needed a knockdown. Okay, so right now, we've just got to deal with the quick draw. The, uh, the missiles are kind of annoying. But they're not shooting very many, so I'm thinking it's a small mech. Alright, so we got, got one guy on the ground. I think I'm going to back up. And I can also do a multi-shot. So we're going to do this and this. And let's see. We'll go B on that and the other just to finish the, the javelin off, I guess. Yeah, let's try that. Engaging multiple targets. All right. Well, we missed with some of that. Didn't quite kill him. But that ought to hurt that guy. Okay, so we didn't kill either one. We're getting a little greedy. And it's... There's the quick draw. That one's gonna hurt. But if you're gonna fire on someone, fire on the awesome. That's fine. It's got plenty of armor. And a turn coming up, actually. So, uh... 
I don't know. Should we... Which one should we engage? I think I'm going to stay where I'm at. I can kill the javelin and just be done with it. Or I can kill the cicada. What do you got? You still got a lot of lasers. I mean, you've got some too. Or, well, you got a PPC. Uh, let's try killing you. All weapons are go. Okay, so it's melted completely. Great. Another one off the board. Target eliminated. And uh, we're going to just... What does this do? Oh, we do not want to get hit, so we want to back... Nah. I guess we just back up like this. Heading out. Trying to avoid the quick draw if I can. Alright, well, fire on the Highlander, that's fine. That's a big spread of missiles, too. I I wonder, do they have, uh, like, a tank or something, or is it a mech? And they're getting point blank. I mean, isn't that out of range for the PPC? A little bit, I guess. Alright. Well, we've got you there. What do we want to do? I think Decker... Decker moves forward... I'm going to start working on this quick draw. I'm not worried about the um, cicada. It's your small time. We're not worried about you at all. But this guy. Firing. Full compliment on enemy. All right. Well, structure exposed is nice. If we can take off an arm. Oh, a headshot too. A bad headshot. Oh, it's got one armor. Okay. Well, we're going to go with glitch then. I hear you. And we're just going to attack, and we're just going to attack you, and yeah, no lasers. And can I, can we precision strike the head? Because if we could just kill you. Got it. There it is, lethal damage, headshot, all right. Did you see that? Did you see it? Yeah, I saw it, that was cool. Okay, so more damage to the Marauder. Probably time to move the Marauder. If we can kill, if we kill the little guy, yeah, which is I think the plan here, we're gonna, in fact, I'm gonna move, I'm gonna move over here and take some shots. And I think the rain does help us, at least it seems like it. We don't seem to be as warm as we normally would. All right, so we'll take off the AC-5. Well, you know what? It's almost a 50-50. We're gonna shoot it anyway. And see, that's why we do it. Nice. Down you go. Alright, Behemoth. Commander. I guess you're gonna sprint over here. And we need to figure out what's over there. We we got the main ones. What's left? What kind of reinforcements did they get? Did they get assaults? Did they get mediums? I mean Whatever it is, they don't have a lot of Ready for orders. a lot of firepower so far. Going full throttle. And he's, he's pretty close to full armor. We'll go ahead and start walking this way. Okay, now it was saying there's something over where... There we go. Oh, a 70 tonner and a 65 and a 60. Okay, so more of the same probably. Good to go. Glitch, I guess we'll sprint you up here. We can cool down this turn. Just want to get away from these little spore pocket things. Uh, you, you get more damage when you sit in those. Okay. We've got the two over there and one up top. Is there a fourth mech that I can't see? Probably. Okay, you're really far back. Let's sprint you over there. I think we're all in pretty good shape. Um, the Marauder is probably taking the most damage. For and Behemoth, we're going to run you into the forest. On You've it. got Bulwark. This will just help. Okay, so we're set up for the next set. Let's wait for the enemy. 65 tonner. Uh, is that a rifleman, maybe? Waiting for orders. Now, Decker, Decker can actually see them, so I guess we'll just do that. Got it. I like the pathing. He, he did a complete turnaround just to get to them, and that is a Thunderbolt. Okay. 
Uh, I mean, we can we could precision strike it, but we've already got a 95% chance. I don't need it to hit anywhere in particular. Just, just go. We did hit the head, I think, though. And the 70 tonner, maybe a warhammer. Yeah. Uh, double PPC. It's gonna hurt. Okay. Well, the warhammer is the the worst of the two. I'm taking heavy hits, Commander. We have no idea what the other one is, but glitch can Wait, now. You can move in a little. You got full armor too. I think your lasers are not going to be able to reach. We're going after the Warhammer. And yeah, let's precision strike these missiles because we want them to hit somewhere in particular. I'm thinking right here. I'd go for head, but I don't think we're going to be able to hit the head. Oh, and they don't have bulwark. That's nice. All right, here comes the. Okay, what's a 60-ton mech with missiles? Is that another Thunderbolt? Alright, and you're way back here. I don't think you can get anywhere. I guess we'll run. I don't want to be in line of sight, though. Not for... Not for this round. Yeah, we'll hide right there. <laughs> Alright, Behemoth. As long as you stay in the weeds, you're fine. Where's all your damage been? Eh, torso on one side. Okay, well, we're definitely going to precision again, and we're going to have to use... We're going to take that torso if we can help it. Although, their aim leaves something to be desired. We finally got it, though. There goes one of the PPCs that makes this thing dangerous. And... Okay, there's the Thunderbolt. And the Thunderbolt's beat up, too, I think. A little bit. Ooh, well, we do have cover and bulwark, so... I mean, it did damage, but not too bad. Alright, Decker. Ready for orders. Yeah. Move order received. Should we try to decapitate the other guy? I mean, I could go for the Warhammer, but I feel like going after the Thunderbolt might be easier. Can we just do a headshot? Come on, roll the dice, be lucky. Roger. Way, way off. Although we did we did cripple one of his legs. We just need to knock it off. We did got a head hit. I mean that's good. Okay, well we can take a few hits of missiles. That's not too big of a deal. It's the PPCs that hurt. Alright, glitch. Yeah, let's move you in the trees Don't also. Well, if we're able to handle heavies, we're doing pretty good. Um, I think, yeah, I think this is who we want to attack. Can we take off the rest of your PPCs, maybe? I guess I could have fired the lasers. Probably should have. All right, he's, oh, is he knocked down? Want some more, huh? No. Oh, but we have a chance still. Okay. So we're going to do, well, <sighs> I think we're just gonna kill him. Let's just go for the kill. All you gotta do is hit anywhere but the bad spots. Come on, man. Not enough. But it did put him on the ground. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. I was really hoping we'd kill him, but that's okay. He's just gonna stand right back up. He'll get to fire a PPC shot at us, but um, with his damage and everything, I don't know if his shot's going to be very good. Okay, it hit, I think, but not horribly bad. Alright, Behemoth. Yes, I guess we can move you more into the open. And can we just kill you? Just kill him, please. There it is. So we were close. All right. Oh wow. Yeah, we really got him. That's a kill. All right. We still have that guy on the hill. Oh, and he's backing up. Is he gonna shoot a PPC? Does he have one? Oh no, he doesn't. He just has a large laser. Okay, good. So there's really nothing to fear of this. I mean, the large laser hurts, but I think Decker. That could probably hurts worse. And then we have the missile, well, at least the mech that's shooting missiles at us. We don't know what it is. 
something with a very few mount. Uh, do we want to go for the headshot again? I feel like if we just... Eh, yeah, we want a headshot again. I mean, he's already taken some hits to the head. This could kill him. In all or not. Oh, we did it. We did it. Right? Ammo explosion. Do we take both legs out? Yeah, run. Okay. Glitch. Glitch is going to move as far this way as they can. And then I think we're going to try to sensor lock. I want to know what's up there. Our luck, it'll be like an atlas. And I don't want to... Oh, wait, no. We think it... Yeah, it's a 60 tonner. Okay, so it's another quick draw. It's odd that it stayed up there, though. I mean, I guess it's got LRM-10. Alright, my guy probably can't do much from where I'm sitting. And depending on how it goes in the next round, do we get to go? Alright, Behemoth, can you, can you sprint up the mountain? The problem is they're way over here. No, I don't want to do that. I want to put them... Yeah, I say we want to keep within our cover here. We don't want to get pulled out of it. All right. Enemy turn. Are they going to come forward? Come to us? Okay. Decker. I think Decker is going to sensor lock. I've got a sensor lock. All right. That's why we were... This is what we're setting up for. Here he goes. And yeah, we'll go for head. Tell me what to do. Now they have bulwark, so this is gonna be a little bit tougher, but they don't have very much armor. Cause we just uh we shredded quite a bit of it. Oh, and I can see it from right here. Which means it's gonna fire at me too. Are we still in cover? I don't think we are. Alright, so all we can hit is... Oh, we can hit quite a bit. Okay, so let's do this. Let's go... Just keep going headshots. Oh, we did some damage. Yeah, your, your chest is almost gone. Alright, can they... They can see if I go over here. I know we can't do anything, but at least we can uh, attack it next round. All right, glitch. Now yeah, we'll just fire everything again. Yeah, that's what we're talking about. Yeah, critical hit. And Decker. Oh, Decker can fire its missiles. That's fine. We'll just. He's very useful in that regard. We can at least shoot stuff from anywhere. Oh yeah, you're you're in bad shape. Can I I can't oh I can still see you. Can I see you better from over here? Yeah, let's do that. Just move just ever so slightly into cover. There we go. And we'll precision. And we're just gonna go for torso. Engaging target. That it? Yeah. So there was only three on that one. Well, we handled them pretty well. I mean, that was seven mechs and pretty decent tonnage. I mean, some of the bigger ones we fought and no problem. Mission successful. Woohoo! Okay, we made some decent money. Let's see what kind of salvage we can get. And look at that. Nobody had their armor chewed through. The awesome took uh, probably the most damage, but even then, not that bad. Okay, it's happening. We, we're gonna get a battle master, so this is exciting. And I think I might take the quick draw. But I wanna look through the parts real quick. We do need to replace some of our weapons with plus plus weapons. We've got quite a bit. Ooh, a comm system. Let's see, stock cockpit configuration takes one slot. Better lance cohesion during combat, including increases the resolve. I mean, that's rare. Is that worth it more than getting closer to having? Because I mean, there's a chance we could have a quick draw too, which is a 60 ton. Is I mean, is that worth it? Do we care? I mean, that's kind of small, honestly. Maybe we should just 
hope we pick that up. And I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for the thing for resolve. I think that's the better. I just haven't seen a comm system before um, that I can think of. Plus, we're getting the Malap Master. I mean, we're getting everything I want right now already. Okay, and we got one quick draw part, so that's not bad. Got the comm system. And the rest of it, you know, we don't care about the javelin, but yeah. That Nick you asked for is cleared for fighting. Yes. All right. Let's take a look at our new mech. Okay, I think it's time to start thinning out what we have. Um, let's see. I think for now, we're probably done with the dragon. Got an arm mod. That's the only thing on it that I think was of note. So we'll go ahead and put you in storage. And I think the Shadowhawk, uh, we'll put it in storage. It'll, it'll lose all of its weapons. We can reuse them. Because I do like the UAC-10. It's 10 tons, though. I think that's a lot more than my... My AC5, maybe. Oh, not much. Just two. Hmm. I might look into that later. All right. And then, so really, the top row is the B, the A team. The bottom row is the B team. Uh, I think we I think we're done with the Griffin. I want that laser though. Ooh, and the plus plus. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna gather all these. All right, and then I think for now we'll leave the Warhammer and the Archer. I don't know about the Centurion either, but we'll keep it just in case we need something quick. All right, so let's do some repairs and some refits on things. Um, for instance, we've got some large lasers that I think are plus plus. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take those. Yeah, there's it, five extra damage and crit. Maybe we can start killing things quicker this way. Okay, I think that's the only thing on this one. Uh, yeah, I mean... Everything else is doing well. I don't like the heat sinks in the legs, but it works. That is why our feet get destroyed so easy. We have no, uh... We have no armor in our legs. I did not even realize that. Hmm. Do we have double heat sinks? I don't think so. Does this fit anywhere? I bet it only goes in the top, but we might be able to put that in one of our other mechs, so that'd be kind of cool. Um, hmm. That makes a huge difference. No wonder we're getting beat up. Because our armor is so low. It's only 90. How are we doing heat-wise? I mean, we're really, really cool. Alpha Strike 68. Yeah, double heat sinks would work well, but I don't think we have any. And I really can't drop anything else. I could drop a laser, but I feel like we're doing pretty good as we are. Maybe... Hmm... I mean, three heat a turn. What if we dropped one heat sink? Like, if we got rid of this one, what happens? We're 51 heat sinking with 68 alpha. So we would, we'd warm up, but not bad. That gives us a ton back and then we can put it in the legs. This, I think that would, that would sure make me feel better. Everywhere else is almost max. I think that's good. So yeah, so we improved one laser. That's something. Do we have another laser available? I don't know. Let's look. Might as well do them both if we can. No, it doesn't look like it. And okay, so that's good enough for now. Yep, that'll take a little while. I'll let you know when that's and see, so do you got mediums? You got some mediums. Let's refit your mediums. Yeah, let's get rid of that one and that one. And I guess we can put this down here. So you've got the double heat sinks. Okay, well, that's that's why you're so cold. Although, do we even need it? Yeah, Alpha Strike is for well. We we gotta put the lasers back on. So before I get excited, I'll I'll look at that first. Okay, so one accuracy. 
That does an extra 25% crit, and that does more damage. So we'll do one damage, and maybe one, one accuracy. All right, now how's our heating efficiency? Alpha 71. So what if we lose... What if we lose one of our doubles? How are we now? Okay, so we actually still... We still are above it, so that's good. So I think I'll leave it like this. So we've got some better mediums. Uh, I don't know if it's worth taking this one out. It does want extra accuracy, so we hit a lot. Love the gauze rifle. I don't think we have a better one. But if we ever come across it, yeah, we'll take that, because that's 75 damage. Okay. Hmm. I could put the gauze... I mean, I don't think there's a difference. There's no real reason to. We're one ton short, though. Can we max anything else out? I think we're good on armor. I guess we'll put in a single heatsink. Put one right there, I guess. Or no, are we out of slots? There we go. Okay, so we'll do that one. Good. That'll take a few days. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. And the stalker has a bunch of missiles and whatnot that we want to probably refit. A little bit tedious, I know, but we've been needing to do these upgrades for a while now. Okay, so there's an LRM 10 that does plus two damage, and then a 15 that does more. So I think okay, so we dropped a 10. We're gonna put this one on. Drop the medium laser down. And then I think maybe this 15, we'll, we'll put it on. And then I gotta, to make myself feel better here, we're gonna shuffle everything down. Weapons go at the top, then the lasers. Okay, so we've got mostly plus weapons. I don't think we have any more 10s though. Okay, we don't, and that's fine. But for lasers, we got, we got some plus pluses. That's a plus 10 damage. Although we don't use the lasers a lot in here. Although this is the only other mech I think that has them, so we might as well put it on. And that one gives you extra crit, so we'll do it on that. So, okay, so, oh, come on. There we go. Okay, so how are we looking? We're also low on leg armor, but I don't see a reason to change it. We don't get in the middle of things very often. The one thing, though, that we could put on is maybe the comm system. So it gives us more resolve. And we use this mech a lot. That might be kind of good. We also have cockpit mod. We gotta give that to someone. Maybe we'll give that to the awesome. Shouldn't be too hard. Or well here's the other question. Do we continue to run the awesome? I like it, but we have a battle master. I mean this thing's pretty good. Uh, let's see, I don't care about the SRMs. I think we probably drop... We got a lot of mediums. Let's see. Well, if we drop the PPC, we immediately... Yeah, I say we immediately fix our heat problems. It only does 50 damage. If we do, you know, like a large laser... We immediately start fixing some of our problems. Okay. And equipment... We've got one double heat sink we could use. We do have two. Let's see, we got machine guns. I feel like machine guns are a waste in this game. They do so little. And you gotta be close. But we'll move the ammo down here. And I'm gonna put the heat sinks in the chest. I don't like uh, surprises. Get the ammo down here too. And move you over here. Okay, so. Yeah, I mean, what else can we put in place of those? I think those are accessories, maybe. Well, we could put ballistics in, AC2s. That's a lot of tonnage, and we don't really have the room. If I get rid of the SRM6, what do we get? Five tons? So we could put in, I don't know, an LRM10?
What kind of tonnage is that? It's five? Yeah, so that would work. We just move everything down. So I think what we'll do is this one will be kind of a backup for now. Yeah, I'm gonna move a couple of these there. Well, it's still uneven. I don't like it. No, oh, I've got another heat sink down here, no wonder. Okay, so we'll just throw you over here. Okay. That gives us still really, really poor heat efficiency because it's the lasers that are getting us. And we don't need the SRMs, so we can get rid of those. And I really want this thing to have a lot more armor. I mean, we got two tons, but we're... Do we need all these weapons? I mean, what kind of heat does the machine gun do? Zero. Okay, so the machine guns are not really wasting anything. And they're only half a ton, so it's one and one, I think, between the ammo and that. Yeah, so two tons. I mean, we could chuck them. I mean, how often are we going to get that close? Maybe we do that. We just gain some more... Gain some more tonnage back. So now we got four tons. We know we're going to have to use at least one to two ammo for the LRM. Alright, so we'll put one on for now. What's that do us? 120. And we're shooting 10. So we can shoot 12 rounds. Probably enough. So let's see if we can go max armor first. Okay, everything's maxed. Uh, we don't need the back to be maxed. I think 100's probably good. The way it does it's weird. Get you... Let's get these armed fully and... Yeah, I don't understand how it chooses to max things. Let's... Drop this down to like 75 each. Okay. Cause we could put more in the chest. I don't know why we're not. They're gonna knock our legs out from under us. Let's go 150 in the legs. Where can we shave from? This arm is not gonna be that big of a use. So maybe we put 100 in that. Okay, so we're down to a half a ton. Maybe we can go down to 90, 80. I don't really want to lose any more heat sinks. We could put a double in. I mean, that. The single. We only have one double, though. That's the problem. Let's see, what are these? Are these, any of these in the engine? No. So, what happens if we put one here? Balance this out a little bit, and maybe we drop. We could drop one. How are we doing now? It's kind of an underwhelming mix right now. Because, I mean, the medium lasers will do a ton of damage, but I feel like the awesome does more. The LRMs are nice, the large laser's nice, but... Ugh. Could also get rid of the large laser, make it completely a medium mech. I feel like, though, the 40 damage is nice. We don't need to shave much, so where should we shave from? I can shave one point here. I don't want. I really don't want to take any off the legs of the arms. I mean, we can do a little bit here. Maybe a point off the head. Nah. Let's take a point off the legs, each one. Okay, so we're just barely. I don't like that. Um, let's do 80 there. That's pretty good. I think that'll work. We're still really, really hot, though. Although, I mean, are we going to shoot the missiles? I don't think we're going to shoot the missiles all at once. So, for now, I think maybe this will work. And that gets us right to 85. Okay. How much firepower do we do? I mean, we do pretty good damage. Max damage is 230. All right, for now, I think this will work. We may have to continue to work on it a little bit. We don't have any plus plus weapons, so whoever gets it, you know, it's gonna be... On it. I'll let you know when that's done. Good amount of damage. So we said, what, 200 and some damage? What does this one do? A lot less, okay, 200. 
And then this one is... I can't look at it while it's being worked on. Okay. Well, not bad. I mean, I think, I think we did pretty good. Let's go ahead and look for a new spot. Are there any other new places we want to go? Um... I don't want to go too far from this. I think we're going to end up back here again. Yeah, let's jump back to Panzer, maybe? Go to Panzer. Okay, back to Panzer once again. Now, during the travel sequence, um, we finally got the opportunity to unlock the black market. So I went ahead and paid the two and a half million C-bills, so you'll notice our money went from 16 to 14. But uh, that's a drop in the bucket. We're doing okay. Um, in fact, I kind of want to get rid of some stuff. So I might, while we're here, go ahead and sell a few things real quick. Because uh, we've got, you know, we've got a decent amount of things. We can get another awesome, too, if we wanted. Let's see. What mechs do we want to get rid of? Uh, I think we want to leave our Centurions alone. I don't have a use for the dragon. We've got two Griffins. Um, four lasers, two missiles. I can't remember which one it was we were using. I think we were using the 1S. So let's get rid of the N. I don't think we need it. We don't need the money super bad, but I'm, I don't want to carry all these. And then we have the 2D versus the 2H. See, that has ballistic, three ballistics and one laser, three... I feel like that's the one I was using. That one's got one ballistic. Honestly, neither one are great anymore. Three lasers is kind of nice. I think we'll get rid of this 2H, maybe? Because we don't use a lot of missiles. And they both have missiles, so it doesn't really matter. Okay. That should be enough money for now. Okay, got us back to 15, which is good enough. We don't need to have a lot, a lot of money. And actually, you know, we need to go take care of our pilots. So let's go do that for a few minutes. A lot of housekeeping in this episode, which usually happens, you know, after we uh, do a campaign mission or two. Okay, so Archangel, yeah, you got nothing. Behemoth, you're getting really close, but you had to sit out some missions. So that slowed you down a little bit. Ready for orders. But Decker, oh, Deckard's fully maxed. Mech warrior training complete. Nice. And we got an achievement. Top of the crew. Commander? Alright, glitch. We're gonna go ahead and max out your guts. I think. Let's double check. That's just unsteadiness. We don't care. Confirmed, Commander. So we gotta get a two more for her and then she's maxed, which is wonderful. And what do I got? Let's see, 6,000? So I need a couple more. I missed out on the campaign mission, which hurt me. Because I uh, was stupid and didn't notice. Yeah, look at those tens. So Decker's at a point now where we can continue to play with him if we want. But we can probably start training his replacement, just in case. And in fact, you'll notice Storm actually has a lot more XP than before. Because we did work on... Uh, let's see, an extra health. I think health would be good. Tactics wouldn't be bad. Honestly, we I'd rather have more gunnery, but we'll go ahead and take guts. You need it. Training complete. And yeah, we already did you. What about rocket? I haven't played with rocket in a while. And whetstone had a little bit of action, but not much. Okay, so I think we're all good there. And I think next time we will plan to take another couple missions. I don't know which ones we want to do. We'll see if this one's got any real quick. Yeah, we got some pirate missions. And... I wish it told us who it was against. It doesn't say. But these are some easier ones. I mean, there's two and a halves, a three... What's that three? A three is a battle, so we'll definitely do that one, and that's a battle. So we got a lot of battles we can do. Plus, we've got some three and a halves, uh, but we got to travel to Weldry, so we probably will pass on that one. So at least three missions we can do next time, we or at least we can choose from. All right, not too bad. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe.